All right, hi everybody, it's Bonka922. Okay, last review of the day. Fairy tale. Fairy tale chapter review. Um, this one was 303. When I saw this chapter, I mean, this was like, pretty much what would happen in this chapter was there were two fronts. Now, beginning a part of it, and that was basically the, the, the whole bit, bit, was the two fronts, and we got everybody at the guild hall, at the hall, you know, at the lodgings, and they're just being informed that Lucy's been captured, well, I should be said, arrested, <laughs> by... The army. And because, you know, she was involved. Mercardius, Yukino, and all that other stuff. So, and that's just like saying, who cares about that? We gotta go save her, you know, and, oh, let me go save her now. Then, Makarov is saying, we cannot act rashly since they're against the king, and then they can't treat the citizens roughly. They're probably using her as a hostage until the Eclipse plan project is blocked. Um, and apparently, you know, Godjil's saying also, you know, how are they leave it, let us leave? Let's see information. They want then Panther is like saying they want us witness to condemn the Cardius in the future. And they're just wondering why is it let him let us leave? Uh, and and then like I think it was uh, Mir Jane who says that we're all participants in the tournament, so it would be really stupid for them to just yeah do that. So. And the nurse is like saying it was irrational that they would arrest Lucy, but this kingdom problem is probably considered just. <laughs> and that's just like, stop, Bobby, let's go say her. <laughs> and Balkarov's like, oh, sit out. <laughs> cool down. And he's like saying, oh, we got a member of our family, there's no time to celebrate. We all sure will all thinking the same. So, pretty much, um, he's saying we're not going to cower against them, and we'll just plan that, the situation out. And then we see an interesting thing about this chapter that I found was Yukino. Now, the reason I say Yukino is because... She brings up an interesting thing about herself with Lucy in the, in the cell. Because they're in the same jail cell. She brings up the fact that she had a sister, Yukino. Remember the filler? Oh. Well, they're in a jail cell, basically. And, and then Yukino's like saying, I attract bad luck. And, he, and Lucy's like, what do you say? If I get depressed, she didn't think a way to escape. Get back those keys. And then you, Lucy's like saying, it's not your fault. You know, in the end, it's all about whether the Eclipse plan should be executed or not, right? I don't like myself. It should, it should be executed. I have an old... And then she goes in saying, Yukino's basically saying she has an older sister named Serrano. Serrano, what I did was always clumsy and made my parents angry, but she always defended me. And saying it's not Yukino's fault, but I really loved her. One day, a sect of belie blind believers of Zerf killed our parents and took my sister away. I was able to escape and save my life. We could defeat Zerf. If Zerf had never existed, my sister would. Not be taken away. So this is the whole premise that 
Kino is doing this to get her sister back, to defeat Zeref, the whole bit. Um, and it's the dan but the danger of changing history. Any time you you mess with fucking time travel, you know it's fucking. It's like. It, it, it's like in Ghostbusters, you don't cross the streams. Well, you don't go back in the past and change things. Because then when you come back, who knows? You might be seeing three-headed lizards. <laughs> so. And Lucy's saying to her now herself, it's impossible to change the past. And then we get to day six. And it's like, hey, was excited. Day six. You know, the last day. Um... And we noticed the guy, the pumpkin guy, he, um, you know, and then he, he decided, I guess the pumpkin, I'm not sure, but I think the pumpkin guy was, is in the announcing table now, so. And we get the introductions of Quattro Puppy, of Blue Pegasus, Lamia Scale, Mermaid Heel. And then we get Sabretooth. Kind of interesting. Now, <laughs> the funny thing about their entrance was Minerva. She's just standing there. She's got this fur around her. I'm like, excuse me? Like, who are you? Big and tall? <laughs> you know, it was very weird. Now, I think a few people mentioned this. Is Sting Toby? I don't know what that's about. I think the people were saying that Sting now is evil. To an extent. Now, it, it they're different, Sabretooth. They don't, they don't look the same. I mean, we got Rogue. He's got a wrap around his face. She's got a fur and shit. It was like weird. And and then he says, oh, then everybody notices, yeah, there's one missing. And he says, Lecter. Leave it to me. I won't lose again. <laughs> and then here comes Fairy Tale. And they notice the members have changed. There's no Natsu. And there's no Lucy. So, Natsu is replaced by Juvia. I don't know if that's a good idea. But she already kind of fought. Well, she didn't really fight. She, she was in the competition portion. But chances are we know what's going to happen for the final day. Chances are Urza's going to fight. I mean, it could be gray, but, you know. Moving on. This has got this kind of weird outfit on and everything. And then we move on. Now. And then, you know, Rogue's saying, oh, Natsu's not here. It's okay, Rogue. We should consider ourselves lucky. And that fucking stupid minister of magic, he's like, they're saying, oh, his magic hasn't recovered. No, asshole. <laughs> it's not that his magic has recovered, it's just he's not there. And everyone's cheering them on and so on and so forth. And then we got Mavis talking to him and saying, you've thought a lot, Six. The end was only one way. If we win the, we might be able to get back Lucia lawfully. However, since we cannot trust their words completely, we cannot fight with only one strategy. Now is the best chance just because everyone is watching busy, watching the tournament. Even we should be able to busy cheering on our team normally. Behind the scene, an extra team is going to save Lucy. Basically, it's a strategy that uses two fronts. And she, he's saying, I leave it to you, Brad. And the, the other team consists of Mirjane, Wendy, and Natsu. 
Now, it's actually pretty good, because when you think about it, I mean, it's almost as you're asking, um, where is it going with them? Because Mary Jane and Nerys are pretty much S-Class Wizards, so you figure. He says, leave it to you, brats. Um, the die is cast, and on the bottom we have the dangerous dangers, two front strategies they determine to succeed. Our next chapter is chapter 304, Diamato Enbu, which is the thing for the, the name for the tournament. Um, and that's what pretty much happened. Good summary. Um, more or less, the only th I'm gonna give this this one three and a half. I mean, this one was was good, not great. It was good, you know. It was good. Um, a saber tooth. I mean, I don't think that. I'm going to say Sting isn't going to be evil for the time being. I'm not putting him in the same category as, you know, you know, he's evil now. He lost Lecter and uh, I'm wondering, <laughs> you know, let's not be too surprised if fucking Gamma's dead. I mean, that's just speculation now. But anyway, I want to say that Sabretooth might be evil. Not to the extent where you want to say, oh yeah, they're all evil. No. Minerva. If Urza fights Minerva... Now, this is the final day, so... Two things are going to happen. One. Urza's going to fight Kagra. Or two. Urza's going to fight Minerva. Um, I think she's going to fight Kagra. That would be really interesting if she fought Kagura. But we don't know how it's going to go down for the final day. We already know what day four was about. So, so far. For this day, who knows? But like I said, three and a half out of five. It's moving along. It seems like they're going to try to rescue Lucy now. And go in there and bring her out. I'm like, that minister of magic is such an idiot. Because... What is the point of doing that? And like they said in the chapter, you know, Malcolm's like saying they're probably just gonna they're doing this to save face, stay face, save face, and try to keep Lucy there. That way the plan can't go through. So But I just think it's so ridiculous because whether or not, it's still going to go through. Not fooling anybody. Yet. But I thought it was informative. You know, we get to see Sabretooth now. They're, they're looking strangely. Something's going down with them. I can see it. That was a big point in this chapter. And the thing with Yukino. So, I think Yukino, she... I'm not going to say she's just like Michelle. Because it seems like they both, Michelle and Yukino, have this connection with their sisters. And the whole point is, is now that she wants to stop this so her sister can live. So she can get back her sister and so on and so forth. Now, we don't know... We still don't know who that mystery person was. Still a lot of mysteries to be brought up to light. But I, giving this a 3.5 and a 5, want to see what happens next week, this coming week, this Friday. It should be interesting because, like I said, it's two fronts. Natsu and Mer Mary Jane. Isn't that funny? Natsu and Mary... It's, it's kind of weird that they said Mary Jane with Natsu because I've never... I don't think I've ever seen a fairy tale. Where he's with Mira Jane. I thought that was very interesting. And Wendy, of course. It's like, Wendy's always with... Them. Change it up, man. Change it up. But anyway.
that was what basically happened. And like I said before, this is going to be interesting, to say the least. Now, hopefully Day 5 fight is really good, because <laughs> you just got to do something with this tournament. He's got to do something. Can't just leave it on like a bullshit on note, you know? Got to do something, man. Come on. So, but I definitely think that after next week's chapter, we're probably going to get into this Cubs plan soon. And that's when the fur is really going to fly. And we're going to really know the whole story behind this and really what's going to go down. So, that's all I got for you guys. This is Bonka 922. Good chapter of Fairy Tale. Um, the title was so late. It was just Comic Con all day. Comic Con all day. So, that's all I got for you guys. And uh, we will see. We will see. Yukino. Poor Yukino. See you guys later.